Hi everyone, Richard here again, uh, down in the Shortcam area, Castle Golf Club. Uh, we are going to talk today about how we use the club to change our trajectory. How do we change our trajectory on a chip shot or a pitch shot? There's two release styles primarily that we can use to help either hit it higher or lower with the same club, without altering ball position, without altering the loft, without altering our setup. We can just simply choose to release the club slightly differently and either get, create a, a lower ball flight or a higher ball flight. Some need to go over bunkers, some will want a ball to release and run towards the hole. So what do I mean by that? Let's talk about this with the ball. It might be easier to describe. Two different styles. How do I hit it low? I'm going to keep the grip going forward as my body turns through impact. What does that mean and what does it look like? I'm going to keep the grip going forward as my body turns through impact. You will notice the head of the club stays quite low to the ground. It hasn't come up past my hip height, it's down below my knees. How do I hit it low? I keep the head low on the way through and I keep the grip going forward. It'll look something like this. That's come out nice and low. It's checked and released out about 10 feet. Now, how do I hit something a little higher? Let's keep it nice and simple. Same setup, but all we're gonna do is we're gonna let the club release a bit more. We're gonna let the, the club head come up as we turn through the impact. It's gonna look a bit like this. I've let the club head come up about hand height, chest height. Kept the speed on the grip. Kept the body turning. And this is gonna produce a lot higher shot. Let's try it out. Ball in the middle again, everything quite simple. Perfect. That's landed in the same spot and it's rolled about three feet. So play around with how you release the club. It's very, very important as ever to keep the body turning no matter what way you release the club. But if you keep it low through impact, you keep the club head low to the ground, you're gonna get a low shot that releases. If you let the club head come up through impact, you're gonna add a little bit more loft. It's gonna come out higher, land, land a bit softer. 